What's going on FM fam? Look, this is by a special request. Y'all wanted to see how this tool works. And the tool that is in question is this one right here. This is what I use to refill all my cooling systems. Okay, it brings it down to a vacuum, gets rid of all the air pockets, and uses the vacuum to suck the coolant back into the system and fill all the nooks and crannies and all that stuff because it's under vacuum, of course. So I'll be showing how I use it. I'm not gonna cut too much. This is just going pretty much be a straight through video. I will cut here and there just to get out some of the fluffy stuff. But yeah, let's get to the action. So on this setup, on this setup we have a coolant reservoir and a radiator. Right. So this one does not have pressure. This is not a pressure cap. Our pressure cap goes over here. Where you want to refill it is where the pressure cap is. If I try and pull a vacuum here, it's going to leak over there. So I have to put the tool over there. Now this is a standard aluminum cap. Uh, comes in all of your coolant pressure tester kits. So I use the coolant pressure tester cap for the Venturi. It's called a uh, vacuum Venturi coolant refill system. <laughs> now I'll put this on here like so. Make sure it's sealed, sealed tight. Get this in frame for y'all. So y'all can see it's at Zero vacuum right now, zero inches of mercury. Now I will make the air hose crack this bleeder or this one open. Now this system is going to take the green coolant, so I got to add green coolant one to one, make sure it's mixed properly. Now any coolant in the system, now any air in the system will create an air pocket, of course. We don't want no air pocket, so I will dip my refill hose into the bucket while it's vacuuming. Crack the line to get rid of any air. And there we go. Turn that off. Let it sit for a little bit. I want to make sure that I don't lose no vacuum because then that means I have to Black, get off your phone. Working. Hardly working because this should have been out already. So what happened? Uh, oh, can you, do the heater? can you do the heater hoses today? You just said bring it up. I know, but now he's like, I go, they're badly leaking. He's like, I, I want to take care of that right now. He's probably going to, he's going to do the other things because he's going to prepay the parts and then he'll do the dry fill. Renee, 1257, Renee. 
He'll do, the, he'll do the drive belt when he does the motor. He wants it done today. Can you do it today? Yeah, but it's gonna be late. Like at six o'clock? There's no way he can leave it overnight. No, he's on the truck. <sighs> All right, what time is it? Y'all see that? I got a leak. Means I have a I don't know where because this vehicle actually I think it's like fitting. I know what the problem is. What? It doesn't say snap on on it. Stupid. <laughs> There's so many aftermarket hoses and warm clamps on here. Wow. crazy is I only replaced this hose because it was leaking right here. All it is is an overflow hose. Now this ain't a diagnosis video, this is just a video on how to use this tool. So I still have to... I still have to fill it up to be able to find the leak now. I pull it back into a vacuum, cut that air off, hurry up, crack that line. Wow, I have this up here because the weight of the water, the weight of the coolant, It'll leave it at like five inches of mercury. It won't have enough vacuum to suck it in. So by doing this, it kind of gives it a downflow. back down here and then rinse the tool off and then rinse the tool off and uh, so we use this tool uh, so yeah now I got some more diagnosing god dang it No, not yet. So if y'all could please like this video, comment, subscribe if you haven't. This video is right here. As usual, subscribe button right there. Well, guys, this is quite interesting. So I looked at another vehicle. It's been about 30, 45 minutes since I put a coolant pressure tester on it. And check it out. It has been holding pressure this whole time. So maybe there was something with my tool. I don't know, but this one's good. I'm gonna ship it out. As I said, videos right here, subscribe right there, and juice. You got a mind, but even that could change. You could flip the gray matter like some batter in your brain.
That's why to say, fake it till you make it, eh? And if you play that game, then you just might make a change. We